Handy resource. Oh, be strong, Alexandra. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Is everything all right? If the Hamlet sent you here to talk to me about... about... I know what I have to do. It's not every day a girl has to put down her own troll. I should be allowed to work up to it. What do you mean, your own troll? I thought that's why you were here. I'm sorry. <sighs> I suppose if you spend enough time with trolls, you forget your manners. I'm Alexandra. I didn't mean to be short with you. With Ranrock's lot seemingly everywhere, I thought the Hamlet could use a bit more security. <sighs> but my plan has gone awry. I apologised when he almost trampled half the Hamlet yesterday. He just needs more time. But everyone wants him gone. They think it's mad, my training a troll. Impossible, even. It certainly takes a lot of courage to try, I'll give you that. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. I wish others felt the same. But I suppose I understand why everyone's been so concerned. What made me think I could train him? I should have learned from Barnabas the Barmy. But he's my troll and my problem. I'll be honest. I'm afraid I won't be able to take care of him. He's stronger than any troll I've ever encountered. I wish I knew someone else who could do it. What exactly were you training the troll to do? I was hoping to train him to serve as protection for us. Frankly, I struggled to teach him even a word or two. Couldn't give him even a semblance of self-control. Who's Barnabas the Balmy? Surely you've seen the tapestry of him at Hogwarts. It hangs in the seventh floor corridor. He allegedly tried to train trolls for the ballet. You can imagine how that turned out. I'm not thrilled at the prospect, but I'll consider it. Oh, no. I didn't mean to suggest that you should do it. In fact, you should avoid the area just southwest of here. At least until I work up the courage to do what needs to be done. <sighs> a troll on the loose near a hamlet. That could be devastating. I take it you're Alexandra's friend. Yeah. 
Storybook. It's done, Alexandra. I took care of him. My troll? What? Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. I wish things could have turned out differently for him. There wasn't much he could have done. He was beyond training. Tried to kill me the entire time. Goodness. I'm glad you're all right. You're very brave. People in the hamlet had already crafted a moniker for whoever eventually defeated my... I mean, that troll. It was troll something or other. Vanquisher? Yes, that was it. I suppose it's your title now. I need some time on my own. But truly, thank you for what you did. The Troll Vanquisher. <laughs> Suppose I did earn the title. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Rebellion. Hello, Hamora. I now, Demi guys. Revelio. Can't imagine how I'd have felt. Wonder who lives here. I'd be terribly grateful if you could help me and my friend Revelio. Time sensitive delivery. you have time to help with an urgent delivery? Revelio.
Seems a pleasant enough little place. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! Revelio! Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! I'd be terribly grateful if you could help me and my friend with a time-sensitive delivery. Revelio. Accio. Guardian Leviosa. Rebellion. Rebellion. Lumos. Valley.
Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Hello. Might you have time to help with an urgent... You sound as if you could use some help. How fortunate to see you. The, um, what was it? Troll, slayer or vanquisher? Whisperer? No matter. You clearly know how to get things done. Eddie Thistlewood's the name. Listen, a friend of mine in Feldcroft needs help fighting Rangrock's loyalists. I sent two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages to help, but they've gone missing. Good idea. Those cabbages are nothing to be trifled with. My thoughts precisely. You see, I know plants, and I believe the goblins will be so irritated by the onslaught of ferocious vegetation, they will simply leave Feldcroft alone. I wonder if you might track the two crates down and deliver their contents to my friend Bernard Indiai. I simply can't leave my shop at present. Why would the goblins target Feldcroft? My friend Bernard says they've been seen in the area for a while. He seems to think they're looking for something, but lately they've become more aggressive. Could you not grow or buy more Chinese chomping cabbages? I suppose I could, but that would take time. Time we do not have, what with Ranrock's thugs posing new threats every day. Besides, it's the principle of the matter. I grew those cabbages, and they are extraordinary. Any idea where I might find the crates? Yes. From what I hear, one was spotted south of Feldcroft. The other, so I hear, is south of Brockborough, near the river. Very well, sir. I shall keep an eye out for two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. Oh, thank you. I shall let Bernard know he might be receiving those cabbages after all. What do you have for sale? I'm convinced that Feldcroft will be much safer with Chinese chomping cabbages defending them. Sounds like Feldcroft's in trouble. Perhaps I should try to help. Thank you. I hope to see you again soon. said that travel broadens the mind. Yeah. That crate of Chinese chomping cabbages is somewhere in this camp. Mora.
Revelio. That's one crate in hand. I only need one more. Incendio. Rebellion. Incendio. Accio. Glacius. Sometimes I do wonder if your eyes are still really the pulse. Revelio. Incendium. Confringo. Compulso. Accio. Repairo. Iondale's not harmed. Rebellion. Reparo. Revelio. Reparo. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Enjoy suffering, do you? I can see why Feldcroft needs help. Ranrock's loyalists are hiding out near Feldcroft. They must have the other crate of Chinese chomping cabbages. <laughs> All the crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood's friend in Feldcroft. That's all the crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood. A special delivery from my dear friend. Hello, Mr. Ndi. Eddie Thistlewood sent me. Yes, he told me to expect you. Do you have the Chinese chomping cabbages? I have them right here. 
Marvellous. This will go a long way towards protecting the hamlet from Ranrock's loyalists. The same foul curs who, I'm willing to guess, intercepted them in the first place, along with Rookwood's lot. Feldcroft owes a debt of gratitude to you and Eddie. Thank you for your help. Do you have any idea why the goblins are attacking Feldcroft? No clue. I used to think it was because of its strategic location, but now it's as if they were looking for something. I will admit, however, that I don't know what they could possibly be looking for. How do you and Eddie know each other? We met at Hogwarts. Been friends and business associates ever since. I wasn't surprised to get his owl about his Chinese chomping cabbage scheme. He was always one to go out of his way to help another. What do you have for sale? At last, some reinforcements. Hopefully this is enough to thwart the goblins. Have I mentioned you're welcome to stop by any time? Nice to see you, my young friend. You'll never believe what I've learned. <laughs> 